Oh yeah, bish. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a brand new series. Oh yeah, bish. One that everyone probably is going to watch at least this episode of them walk oh, away. Oh yeah, bish. But we hope you'll stay with us because we've heard so much about this game. Oh yeah, bish. Time to settle the score. Welcome. Time to go to ham. The Order 1886. Debut game from Ready to Dawn Studios. Now this game came out on the PS4 last year? It came out... Or 2014. It came out February 2015. 20, so last year. Yeah. Um. Everyone and their mother hated this game. They didn't hate it. It was just short. So this game is was had been like in development for like five years uh -huh. and it was announced in 2013 uh -huh. as like a new PS3 game. Everybody was like, Oh shit. And, uh, the game is about f like five hours long or something like that. Oh, so it's a real short game. Yeah. But the tech is supposed to be very impressive and the game itself and the world it builds is all supposed to be very neat. I, I believe it has something to do with like an order of like Arthurian knights that like goes throughout the years and like protects the world from like monsters. I bought this game for six dollars from GameStop. Hell yeah. So I don't know what that means. Here we go. So the question is, does a game's length contribute to its goodness? I don't think so personally. And is goodness different than worth? I think it depends on the on on uh, the price tag, really. Well, well, yeah, I mean somewhat, but like is but like okay, let's go to use like food as an example nothing is whoa we're just right in there point is like food that you pay a lot for is gone faster than most things and you pay a lot for but like some people like people still think expensive food is worth it so if this game is one of the most amazing looking like technological achievements ever but it's only five hours long maybe that is worth sixty dollars That's kind of what I want to see today. Giving up the ghost now, <laughs> Fancy enough a rant. So we're being like tortured, basically. I guess so. <clears throat> yeah. By the way, we neither of us have played this. We are going in. We know nothing. Blind. Completely blind. Just that every, we just know that everyone hates it. We everyone says something about this game. So. Yeah. I'm excited. <laughs> Maybe if you haven't played it, this will either convince you to play it, or it'll give you a way to experience it without having to commit to playing it. Don't worry. We'll come back and have another go later. Right. Come on, come on, get up. Up you get. Get up. I wonder what this game is gonna like. What the vibe of this game is? Is it like a spook, spook boy? Is it like a spook fest? I know it's like a horror vibe. Oh, come on, you pick it up. Yeah. Not a good day for our boy, whoever this boy is. Yeah, we have no idea what's going on at this point. Is that we're we are a prisoner? You probably know something. You're a prisoner. Sweet dreams, mate. Or they're just fucking with you. Okay. Right. Rough morning for our boy. Time for your morning bath, my lord. Does that mean we're gonna get dunked again? I guess so. <laughs> what if this game is just a, like getting dunked in a British prison simulator? Whoa. You look just like them. Like pretty old dude. Well, this right. I don't think he's gonna last. Once a night. <laughs> oh shit, 1886, just like the title. That comes to Westminster. Was it? Here we go again.
The only game this company made before this game was Daxter for the PSP. You're about ready. These things take time. Put him back here. And I think they made the Ghost of War of Sparta and Chains of Olympus games. Those games were great. Yeah. Triangle boys. Come on. Yo, is this the game engine? Yo! Oh shit, oh shit, I gotta do something! Oh shit, are these game graphics? <coughs> Damn! He kind of reminds me of like Wolverine. Press and hold when this prompt appears. Got it. This game looks incredible. Dude, yeah. Holy crap. Wow, dude. Let's do it. Oh. Dude, this looks fucking good, dude. You don't even see PC games that look this good that often. You mean having sex with your wife? Yeah. I knew that. L3 is run, basically. Holy shit, this shit looks real as fuck. I like that the game is in letterbox, too. Yeah, I, I just know. noticed that as you said that. I don't know if it's gonna stay in letterbox, but the only other game I played that was in letterbox I really liked, uh, The Evil Within. It, it really sort of lent like a really cool sort of vibe to the game. Oof. Get up. Get up, British Wolverine. Get out of your pajamas. Is it a gun? Oh, dude. L.A. Noir. Oh, man. Yo, bullet boys. Just my luck. Out of bullets. Aren't there like bullets on the ground right there? You just pick them up and use them again? That's how bullets work, right? Right, you just, you shoot the bullet. I'm a proud gun carrying member of the NRA, so obviously <laughs> I would know. All right. Just gonna hobble just my like way a through dead here. Skeleton? Oh. We're gonna bash it? You're just gonna climb out of this, like, sewer hole? Oh shit. Uh-oh. Go, baby, go, baby, go, baby, go, baby, go, baby, go, baby, go. Go faster, my dude. You in control? I am now. Let's go, baby, let's go, baby, let's go, baby, let's go. Here they come. Here they come, here they fucking come. Move forward. Oh my god. Go. Just give me some serious, some serious, some serious willies. Yeah? You're getting some wills right now? I was just worried that somebody was gonna like. Chris, hit you. put a picture of Will Smith and let let, Big let Alex style. know it's okay. Thanks, man. There you go. There there's some willies for you, Alex. <laughs> Thank you, dude. Got you, man. Push and hold left and then press circle. Did you just do that? Yeah. I wonder how good these controls are gonna be. For like fighting. Oh, oh shit, shit, that's what a full on werewolf. It's gotta be a werewolf. It's a Wendigo, dude. 
Oh, dude, Rise of the Wendigos. This oh is their origin God. story. Are we just like werewolf killers? Are we like werewolf people? Are you a werewolf? I have no idea. Is it an order of werewolves? Dude, this guy has had a Something rough is happening. afternoon. I cannot move ahead as well as it should let me. Something is going to happen. Can I go back? No, I can only go forward. Oh my god. Just been getting tortured for weeks. Hands up. Alright, mates. L2. Not a word. Inside. Close him. Grab his gun. Let's just talk this through. Who's right? having the worst day now? That's the question. No one knows, dude. Him or the guard? No one knows. You're him, aren't you? The convict everyone's talking about. There's only one way out of here. What? Walking dead, that's where you are. Gotta wish you never left those catacombs. Such a mouth. Fair enough. Fair enough, it's your funeral, not mine. Oh, it's gonna be yours because we're the best. I have a feeling that we're the main character of this goddamn video game, so unless this game is a lot shorter than we fucking think, you're the one who's gonna get bopped. He has a gun! He has a gun! Whoa, fellas, whoa! <laughs> you just died, dude. Gunfight! Literally. <laughs> you fucked up, bud. Jesus Christ. Oh. Oh, you have to like... Oh, damn. Okay. So there's gonna be a lot of button pressing in this game. Yeah. I know a lot of people don't like that, but I think it's kind of cool sometimes. Oh, I'm putting you down, buddy. You're going to bed. You're going to bed, you're son. You're going to bed, son. Mm, you're going to Ooh, bed, you're gonna go to son. real bed. You getting oh, sleepy? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, dude, sleeps? he's turning purple, you're dude. getting sleepy, my dude? Oh, oh, he's not going to bed. He ain't going to be in the Order 1886 too. <laughs> <laughs> Order 1883. Up, my next shot will not be a warning. Oh, yeah? What? He didn't shoot him. They want something from us. That dude? Everyone does. I think you're like somebody. Someone famous? Yeah, like maybe you're like a prince or some shit. The play is over, Galahad. Galahad? Surrender yourself. Raise your hands now. Oh my god, are you like the immortal Raise Sir Galahad? Hands up. Gray? Don't do this. I said surrender. Going to low key just kind of just peace out. out. Hands on your head. Get out of here. You have betrayed our order. No one may escape the penalty. You forget, Lord Chancellor. I'm as good as dead already. Oh. So those guys had the order logo on their clothes. The uh, the guys that were yelling at him, but those guys didn't seem like the same guys that were the guard guys, right? Yeah, yeah, I got that vibe too. What are we? What are we looking at? Oh, he's got a radio. Does this game take place now? Galahad, acknowledge this is command. Oh. Oh, is this back in time? Nothing quite like a chilly London morning to stimulate the senses. Always night, chapter one. 
We have confirmation of multiple marks at Grosvenor Square. What are our directives? Plimps. Rendezvous at the United India House with the grain and So this is earlier, yeah. The threat. Do you have it in sight? The United India House? Is it going to say it on it? I don't know. Hold up. Oh. Right in front of me. Good. Assess the situation once there and proceed with caution. Did Nikola provide you with armament? Nikola Tesla? Yes. SXM2 Falchion. Good. The Falchion secondary ordnance should help. What? We may be pursuing Bedlamites, but they remain civilians. Use non-lethal force whenever possible. Stealth? Understood. Maybe? I have a small matter to attend to. I'll find you afterwards. En route now. Dude, this is hype. Got out. Let's go. I'm into this. Yeah, I just don't know what, to, what we're doing yet. We're on a mission. Oh, yeah, I'm controlling. I thought there was a cutscene still. Yeah, because it looks fucking good as fuck. I think we're just like on a mission to this house. I think we're gonna like figure out what we're doing as we go. So you so can I run with L3, right? Not anymore. Oh, maybe you're in like indoor boys. Yeah, I can't do. God damn, though. Look at this. This looks great. Dude, I hope this isn't like a straight up horror game because this is uh This looks like too real for me. Like I would be I'll I'm gonna I'll get scared. <laughs> <coughs> Meet with an ingrain. Ingrain. Ingrain directive. Is that him? Click and hold to Oh, okay. Is that him right there? Morning. Nope. That's just some... Um, he doesn't even give a fuck. He looks like his name is Giuseppe. Seppi? Giuseppe. Giuseppe, who are you? Pretty lady. I'm the ghost who inhabits this painting, Gerard. I am Martha Stewart's younger sister. Younger! That's a real photo. Triangle? G. Wyndham? 20th of July, July, 1886. Shout out to the W. Thompson Portrait Studio. I wonder if they're still in business, and if not, rip. Wishing you the best. Day, Are you Igrin? We're meeting G over where? <laughs> where are we meeting G? Alright, what is this? What is that? Oh, it's like an audio log? Phonograph cylinders. Contain. Wait, is it the archive? Yeah. It befell in the days of Uther Pendragon, when he was king of all England, and so reigned that there was a mighty duke in Cornwall yeah. that held war against him for a long time. Far lady, and fair lady. The duke of Tintagel. Igraine. It's so a woman. By means, king Uther sent for this duke, charging him to bring his wife with him, for she was called a King Arthur's lady. wife. And a passing wise, and her name was called Igraine. She told the Duke her husband and said, so I suppose we were safe. would come unto the king. By the means of great lords, they were accorded both. The king liked and cool. loved this lady well, and he made them great cheer out of measure, and desired to have lain by her. But she was a passing good woman, and would not assent unto the king. And then she told the Duke her husband, and said, I suppose that we were sent for that I should be dishonored. Wherefore, husband, I counsel you that we depart from hence suddenly, that we may ride all night on oh. our own castle. So Arthur wants to fuck the Duke's wife. And the Duke's wife was like, I'm not just gonna like I'm let you call me up so you can be gross with me. Let's leave. But if you're Arthur I don't know who you are to Igraine. If you are an immortal person or if these are all code names, I don't know. Just trying to figure it out. Well, the day was 
1447, so... Right. That's also, like, a book by Sir Thomas Mallory. It's not a real book, but, like... Right. It could be about you guys in this world. Sure. Maybe that's what the order is. Maybe the or order is the Knights of the Round Table. He called you Galahad is the only reason I'm like... Yeah, that would make the most sense. <clears throat> Galahad, the Grey. Any word from the Hoya? Negative. Same here. He's probably off somewhere gallivanting. Damn, dude. Well, himself. I know your concerns. But trust me, he's a good lad. Did you say so? Okay. Trash can boys. Charles Dickens. Luminous City. Marvelous play. Ring of Nibelung. Wagner. Nothing. <coughs> All right. So little flavor, little flavor boys. Playing this Jesse Cox style, soaking in as much as we can. Look at the, like, tops of the buildings a little bit. Okay, wow. It's Dude. Pretty solid. This shit looks fucking good. Like, say what you will about this game. So far, it looks really amazing. Like... <coughs> I'm into it. It's just a little slow right now. Yeah, I mean, like, all these games are so cinematic with their story. Like, that's like a question you always ask is like, what's the point of a video game? Is it to tell the same type of story as a movie or is it to be its own kind of thing? So you always have to like kind of decide like what the role is. I mean, I don't know where this game lands like on the scale of like The Last of Us, but you know, there is, I, I do believe there is like room for cool did you, games. Did you just see that? Yeah, I don't know what happened there. You're like wound up to like... To my dearest. To my dearest. Is there a... Just gonna leave it? I can't do anything else with it? I think it's just kind of teaching you, like, how the world works. Like, it's just showing you, like... Sure. Sometimes there's, like, interesting shit around that you can see. Yeah. Galahad. See that you cordon off the entire... See Galahad. And do it quietly. And Igraine. How did you arrive here so quickly? Skill, love. I must admit, it's all skill. you do move fast for a man of your age. And I curse to be reminded of his decrepitude by a fair damsel. My lord, this damsel would never be so callous as to do such a thing. Sure is he. Would you ever? <laughs> is he? Is her name Igraine, or is it Isabel, or is it is... I don't know. Who are the marks? Bedlamites running amok. Bedlamites. It could be a rebel subterfuge. <sighs> Let's hope you haven't lost your edge. Remember who trained you? He was the best. In his day. Roasted. You're still pretty good. But I'm better. Yes, ma'am. Hey, Rain, come in. Acknowledge Percival. Multiple escapees okay. spotted at the east entrance of the United India Underground Station. Intercept with caution. So you're like the like British X-Men? Come on, Gray. Let's move. You're like the LXG? <gasps> I don't know. Click and hold R3 to display the point of interest associated with the directive. So we're following Igraine. You can run after her, right? Nope. By pressing L3? Oh, did it just give you the power to run again? I think it just did. Cool. So we're going into that building there, and we're going to deal with some jerk boys. Once we're inside, don't let anyone else through. Sure you don't need help, love. So you're working with the cop boys? Do you mean a strong man to take control of things? That's right. Just stay out of our way. I'd hate for you to get shot by mistake. Damn. Trouble. The usual trigger happy mercenaries. The United India Company prefers its minions enthusiastic. The last thing we need is a band of hired guns causing more havoc. I've told them to remain on lockdown. Preach it, sister. Oh, we're going in. We're going in to kick some ass. About to kick some ass now. So far, so very, very beautiful. I 
That's the thing about this game is that it looks gorgeous. I mean, everything about it. Like, the art direction is amazing. The voice acting is pretty good. Oh, press circle. Shoot this motherfucker in the head. Let's get to work. No problem. Papas, papas. Boop. Got him. Target down. Got him. We're clear. Move up. So it's like a cover based shooter. I think your gun is probably better. Probably. <coughs> oh. Yo, are these like mental patients? Yeah, I think bedlamites. That's what bedlamites means. It's like, like insane people. Like, well, it's different back then because it's like crazy house could be anything. Could be crazy people, sick people, like political prisoners who are like being squelched. Primary. Boop. Later, dude. Later, dude. Late. Oh, later, dude. What is R1? Someone heading for the atrium. Oh, that, that was R1. What did it do? It's like a mist or something. Escape me down. Huh. I wonder what it is. Try and pop that guy. Oh, he she got she took him down. Try and pop somebody with that mist and see what happens. Oh, health boys. Or no, what is that? Bullets? Ammo. Got it. Oh, to your left. Whoops. There we go. Oop. Nice. Nice. Dude, just murdering these dudes. This guy Come right. on. Come on. See that guy to your left? Oh, right in front of me? Yeah. Try and R1 somebody who's near you next time. I'm interested to see what that's about. God damn, this looks fucking real. Oops. Alright, let's try it. Oh! Oh! Yo, it's your non-lethal, that's what it is. It's a stun. Oh, right, he did say to go non-lethal, didn't he? Oops. Well. I'm sure we're fine. Fuck it, here we go. Literally no one has said anything. Oh, man, just hammered him right on the top of his head. You got him. Pursue... Pop into the building. Press triangle. Oh, she's gonna do it. They've locked the door. Yeah. I can hear more commotion inside. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. oh. Hurry. More bedlamites inside. Right. How do I open the door? Oh, there we go. Boom. Oh. Done. Take the shot. Oh. Oh shit. She was not fucking around. Yeah, so it's like if somebody rushes you, you can be like, shut the fuck up, get out of here. Sure. Oh! <coughs> Are you alright? Damn it! What? What? What is that doing? Maybe it's like healing potion? Oh, sh- Oh! God, it's slaughtering them. Ready? Get rid of this scum. Smoke grenades. Right. Smoke grenades. Smoke out. All right. Let's go. Well, shit. Nice. 
bodied, sir. I'm, I'm Batman. <laughs> What's up? I'm Batman. Hey. I think you can probably hop the bar with X. You're right. All right. All oh, right. You might I know. Need to kill some of those guys. I'm just getting real happy as. Hey, I said cover. A little kill or be killed action going on. Oh. Sorry, just uh. No, no, having, Jaw feel. Having a little too much fun no, right no, now. No, no, Jaw feel. Oop. There you go. Nice. Where did that shot come from? Behind you? Jesus. Oh. Alright, stay chill. I bet you could, like, bop him in the face with that stun. Oh my god, hilarious. Gotcha. Sorry, bud. Oh shit. Oh. Oh! Got him. I'm gonna There's die. another dude right there, though. He's gonna take you out. Where is he? Oh, oh. shh. Oh my god. Ah. Got him. Fuck you, bud. Oh! That's what the fuck I'm about. What's up? Get down, What's baby. Up? What's oh up? shit, you just What's shot him through. Oh What's my god. Up? What's You're, up? Oh my oh my god. What's up? Oh my god. Oh my god. What's up? It's a good app. Use it. Oh my god. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> Sorry. He got charged. I got a little excited. He got a little charged. Got a little a little excited. We should clear the second floor. That was actually really cool. Nice solid mechanics. I like the stun thing. Everything to your liking thus far? I'm working on it. Just another ordinary London morning. What happened to your shoulder? Indeed. Why did you drink a potion and now you're fine? Oh, I do hope that was only the beginning. Why why do you have a potion that can cure you with like with like magic? No one knows, dude. Ooh. You think we'll get to shoot a few of them rich folk? Huh? Say no more. Just gonna oh. go ahead and uh oh. take you out behind. Oh, oh my good night. god. Good night. I guess they weren't super serious about the non-lethal. Alright. Next time on Beard Bros, we clear the second floor? Sure. Let's do it, man. That, that guy's eye is twitching. Yo, I'm into this. Oh my god. Now they all oh. know you're here. Oh, sorry. Next time on Beer Bros. <laughs> Next <laughs> we'll, time on Beer Bros. Next time on Beer Bros, we'll deal with this. Alright, later, man. Later, man.